Saturday softball from the Plex and the parking garage that overlooks Joanne Graff Fields will be packed here this afternoon. Why wouldn't it be? Top 20 matchup between Florida State and Duke. The curveball mix that makes Reed so effective. She does a good job climbing the ladder. Right back to the circle. That's a good start for McKenna Reed. One down. The talented Deanna Jennings, who played really well last night. Standing third baseman, 328 on the year. Six blasts and works the walk. That is her 12th walk of the season to just eight strikeouts, a patient eye at the plate. Trying to squeeze her both inside and outside. Catches this one. It's going to be a tough play, but Flaherty running grab into the outfield. Trying to work her really far in on the hands, even far out of the zone, too. In on the hands to Vega, underhand toss. Flaherty records a couple of outs in the inning. But can respond? I think the vibes are good. Not under it, a touch. Shallow right center field. And it's Jennings, calls everyone off and makes the grab. As Alex alluded to the outstanding rookie season for the lefty. Hit hard, base hit, that's what Jason E. Beecham does. night through what the first four or five innings I think it would be safe to say on the ground slow dribbler only chance is at first base and Vega makes the smart play it's this hard tailing away right field got some carry to it stuck at the wall that's gonna do damage run scores Florida State strikes first and great hitters go the other way. And look at that pitch off the plate. But Harding has such great plate coverage. Absolutely tattoos that ball down the right field line. I love that piece of hitting. She's fired up, telling her dugout, let's go. Let's see what we're made of. Duke's 4-0 in the ACC now. That one pops out of the glove, allows Harding in the third. Fans remember her dad, Gerard, who played at Florida State. As this one also tailing away, dropping fair. And Ross can fly, watch this. She's in the third with the triple. Florida State doubles its lead. It's almost like we spoke that into existence there. Ball down the line. Nice little piece of hitting there. Two strike count. Just absolutely places that ball perfectly. Nice attempt down the line. Filling some what we feel to be big spots. No doubt. Hits this one on a line. That ball's got carry. More extra bases for Florida State. The big inning continues as Ross touches home. The freshman drives in the third run of the game. Great piece of hitting by Issa Torres. Again, going the other way. Off a curd. You know that she's got the velo working up in the zone. You've got to let the ball get deep. Trying to get your hands back through the ball. That's now the one-two. Edenfield flies it to center. Jennings squeezes, and the side is retired. Four hits in the inning result in three runs. The week on the 20th. We got the Wednesday, if I'm not mistaken. Strike three called as Torres caught looking. It's going to be that level of All-American. As Burgess hits it hard, it stays up long enough. How about Janai Kerr? Not only are you dealing with pressure to perform, then you're dealing with information. And everybody knows what you throw. Clarity gets a cross strong throw. And the side is wages. Off the end of the bat, dropping Jennings, Web Gem herself. Wow, the defense is so. All on the ground, Vega. Ooh. Retired Flaherty, but it was Tapia. <laughs> Skies it to center. It's got some carry. Jennings drifting, makes the grab. Onto the track. Indeed, we just needed 24 pitches in her first two innings. Baker driving it. Her, she can really fly. Covers a lot of grounds. And in the right center, not a problem for the Knowles. Goddard had base hit. Last night. 
swing and a miss. The heat from Kenny Reed. Get the Knolls back into the dugout after that three spot in the bottom of the first. Outside corner, Frozer. That hits Beecham. Combo that they saw this afternoon. If they could get to Curd, they were going to see Walker. She gets Kerr to sky one into the air. And Vega's got it. Started with Jayla Wright, who was phenomenal. Now, is this a gap shot? And Davidson's not going to get there. Beecham's going to get the wave home, rounding third. And the throw missed the cutoff. RBI double, Kaylee Harding. Kaylee Harding, back-to-back -back doubles here, takes that off-speed pitch. I love that identification there, out of the hand, just sits back, keeps her hands and weight back, drives that ball, left center gap. Good effort out there, Dave Ripples. They're legit. Off the end of the bat for Ross. Park will hold it. And that time, an easier play for Davidson. Two away. Torres, it'll stay in the infield. And Baker's got it. Florida State picks up one more on the job of not leaving anything down the middle. And a gold off the end of the bat. Oh, Beecham snares it, fires across. The first out of the inning, the reporter. Beats it out, momentum shift, right? You, you never know. And the butterfly effect is real. Davidson hits it hard, and Duke can't catch a break. That one was right to Waycaser. Hey, Alameda Calder, one of the faces of our entire team. Swing and a miss. Another a strikeout for McKenna Reed. That's times in her career. 281 to 255, and now to where you see it at 349. Strikes out that time. And that's Hitters count for Waycaser. Diving grab. Anna Golds. She's made some really great plays throughout the season. A couple hot shots over there at the hot corner. Jam shot. And Golds. Ranging in to make the grab. One. Behind the plate here this afternoon. Inside out swing. Waycaser played it perfectly. First out of the inning reported for Waycase. That's why it's so good as a hitter to know your weaknesses. Up the middle, and there's the first base hit of the afternoon. In the fifth inning, it's Burgess. Was able to break up the no-no. Being able to hit the ball to the other side of the field, opposite field, crucial. Pulling balls, of course, crucial. On the grounds, Flaherty will opt for work. Just one. Reads one, two. Here to Baker. Swing and a miss, strikeout number five. And Florida State star and sophomore pitcher in the circle, Strands, a runner. Beecham coming in to score. Mudge, short game, who want to play? Retires the Knowles left fielder. Yeah, you got to take it on purpose. It's tough, I know. Beecham off the end of the bat's going to find the grass in front of Sarah Goddard. Another hit for Beecham, her second. She's reached safely. Attack. Potter gonna go, throw down in time. Torres gunning Potter. Florida State getting aggressive. Well, there. Legion athletics are not your thing. On the ground is short. Baker charging in, makes the play. Billy Walker's done a really nice job. Interesting piece about this matchup in front of the tag team that they have. Four pitch walk, not the start. I think that. Yeah. 
Short game, Beecham's got to hurry, throws it back to second. It'll be a base hit for Jennings. Duke now threatening here in the sixth. Four, can't leave it too open. Skied out to left fields, Mudge will make the grab one away. Another hard hit ball, that's gonna get down. Coming around third, it'll be Freelich. Duke's on the board in the sixth. Claire Davidson, the top hitter for this Blue Devil team. Look at that pitch, just taking it down in the zone, dropping barrel. Beautiful, smooth, lefty swing. Janai Kerr doing a good job, though, here. Splitting the runners, throwing it into the cut, throwing that ball immediately to second base. What you don't want to do is overthrow your... Center fields. Kerr makes the grab. Burgess can fly, and she'll touch home. Sack fly for Vega. Cuts the seminal lead to two for Lauderdale. Hits it hard into the gap. Base hit. First to third goes Davidson. It's a two-out life here for Duke on the road. And groove and you just want to keep rolling. I can't dance, so I don't know. Little floater, Torres measures it running in. <laughs> McKenna Reed jumps for joy. And the side is retired. He's digging in the box. Florida State consistently stays in the back of the box too, which I love. She wants the walk. She's been all on base in all three plate appearances. Have to come in and really giving her team a shot. Inside, Belvai goes, they're testing Torres, and she's making him pay. Second time she's gunned down a would-be base stealer at second. The throw from the knees, I was always a fan of that. I was never a catcher, but if I was, I would definitely want that skill. Ross, left fields, and Burgess, who's playing out there, who won to the Knowles shortstop. Loops it into left field, Burgess diving in and makes the grab. Side retired, the defense. On the ground, Flaherty, good range, throws across. And one down. That's a veteran making a big play for you when it counts. Force things off with Kenna Reed, who's found so much success with that same approach. This one should stay for Ross. She makes the grab two away. And Florida State, he's right back. Zampa, caught. Belvi has it, and we're tied. Here between the Blue Devils and the Knolls, the rubber match set for to tomorrow. McKenna Reed outstanding. Early offense for Florida State. A packed house saw a really good softball game. McKenna Reed lights out seven complete, came in and just absolutely responded. Florida State 